Okay, here we have the teenage stocking. Um, these are really cool. It's the teenage stockings are really kind of difficult to assemble because they're just so wide range and at that point in time, that age group, it's really hard to not know whether you're going to have a male or a female um, stocking to make because we don't get that information ahead of time. It's just um, we have this many teens. So uh, that, that gets kind of difficult, um, but I think we do a pretty good job in figuring out what to do with that. So um, one of the really cool items that we have for the teens. Um, at first we were like, well, let's, you know, do some earbuds or whatever. I think that's what we did the first year. We just threw some earbuds in there, but I was like, you know what, let's go one step further. And so we got this really cool product. Um, we got these Bluetooth headphones for them, which are so cool. I'll show you kind of a little, so they kind of fold up like that and they pop out and they're Bluetooth. Um, and they have like the little volume on the side. I don't want to mess with them too much right now because they fit perfectly in here. Um, but they're really great quality and um, they really loved them last year. So we decided to try for that again this year. And we actually have all of them in hand for Christmas and for the Christmas in July. So thank you guys so much for helping out with that because these are like one of the coolest items for the team. So thank you so much for helping with that. Um, so yeah, that will go in there. Um, this might actually be like a swag bag item this year because last year we kind of had to attach it and it was kind of weird and mangled and looked kind of funny, but it served its purpose and the kids loved them. So, um, there's that. So we also have some great little socks for the kids. So we will put those in there, keep their toes warm. I don't really know what to put in there first. Well, we'll put Canoodle. We have Canoodle Game, which is um, the same as the um, young or the school age kids. Some of this stuff overlaps with school age and teens because um, they work pretty well together. Um, we have the Blink Game as well. Um, put those in here. Those are the bottom. We have another one of those fidget, the rainbow ball. Um, kids like to play with that stuff. Uh, we have the memory game as well. Again, for these stockings. Then we might have to take that out and kind of assemble it in a different way. Um, Here's that. Um, these I think come with a bag in it, so we might actually be able to just take this out of the box to make it fit in the stockings better. So that will go in here. Put the socks in there, kind of sticking out the top. This is just a rough pack, real rough. <laughs> um, we have a pop socket, these are so cool. Um, Kids love to have them on their phones and all that stuff. And the cool thing is it's like a little EKG thing with a little heart in there. So um, those are pretty awesome. I think the kids are going to love them. Uh, we had them in there last year too, and they liked them. So um, we also have the joke book for the teens. So we can put that in there. Kind of rough stuff, so I don't want to shove anything in there. Again, we have the Elf Popper. Elf Poppers are awesome in the Coster household. We love to have wars with them. Uh, we have an elf. We have a hang, no, an elf, a snowman, and a reindeer, Rudolph. Um, and then we have Battleship. Again, this is the travel, travel game, so we'll kind of disassemble it or take it out of the box and assemble it for them so it's kind of ready to go for them once they get it. And this... It's a huge box, but the game is actually a lot smaller than it, the box make it look, makes it look. So then we can kind of put it here in this empty space and that'll kind of fill the stocking out as well as the elf popper. Um, and then again, with the swag bags this year, with the teens, this is so cool. So we have 
some cool stuff for them, but their items are a little bit bigger. So we're going to put the stocking and then we're going to put it in a bag. So they're going to have the headphones in there, which is going to be awesome. And then I also thought it would be cool um, to do slippers for them. Those are on order. I ordered a pair um, as a donation from us. I, I ordered a bunch of stuff, but um, one of the pairs of slippers is going to come, I think, tomorrow. So uh, we'll have a cool look at those. They're Happy Feet, which are also a huge favorite in the Coster household. Matt got us like hooked on them. Matt has, I think, gone through three or four pairs of Happy Feet. Uh, they're kind of like a, a slipper shoe. It looks like an actual shoe with shoelaces and stuff, but it's a slipper and it's really comfy. I've gone through like two or three pairs as well. Um, they're really awesome. Um, and then also for their walks around the unit, on top of like the slippers that they get, um, we thought it would be really cool for them to have like a robe so that um, because they're always attached to a bunch of stuff, there's always stuff on their chest. So we thought it would be nice if they had a nice, warm, comfy robe um, to walk around in as well or just have in bed and just be nice and cozy. So we got one of those for the teens. Um, and then we also have, I think we have a couple more on Amazon right now um, available for purchase as well. Um, I think that'll be a really cool addition to their gifts this year because it is really super comfy cozy and that's the one thing that I would want if I was in the hospital for the winter is something to be really cozy in. So uh, that's the teen stocking. I think they're looking pretty good so far. I might have to give one or two things to kind of fill the feet and stuff, but I think they're looking pretty good. So thank you everybody.